Good morning, everybody. The craziest thing happened this morning. Well, okay, it's not like the craziest thing, but something did happen. So I was getting ready for work this morning at 4.45 a.m. I woke up at four and I was about ready to head out the door. I was getting my stuff together and then I get a call from crew scheduling and I'm thinking what on earth could they be calling me about right now? So obviously I answer it and I talk to them and they tell me that my original flight has now delayed until noon. The original flight was supposed to take off at seven. So that means it was a five hour delay. Obviously that is pretty significant. So they moved my sign in time from 6 a.m. until 11 a.m. Which for me is fantastic because I got to go back to bed and sleep for three more hours. I also got to take Luna out for some frisbee time. Originally, we were supposed to have two flights today. We were supposed to go from Dallas to Phoenix and then Phoenix to Detroit. However, because this first flight to Phoenix was delayed by five hours, we are missing that flight to Detroit. So that flight has been taken off of our schedule. And that doesn't mean that that flight canceled. What's gonna happen is they're going to have reserved flight attendants in Phoenix cover that specific flight. So what is kind of interesting about all of this too is we were supposed to have two flights tomorrow as well because we were gonna lay over in Detroit tonight but since we are missing that layover in Detroit we actually only have one flight tomorrow we were supposed to go Detroit to Phoenix and then Phoenix to Las Vegas but now since we'll never even be in Detroit we're just gonna go today to Phoenix and then layover and then tomorrow Phoenix to Las Vegas quick meal prep before I head out the door. This is definitely not the healthiest meal prep I've ever done for a trip, but at least it's something. I have some fruit over here, an apple, some little mandarin oranges, and some raspberries. This is an energy drink that I'm actually going to save for the last day of this trip because we have a very early morning. I have this maple brown sugar instant oatmeal, so I'll probably have this for breakfast one of the days of the trip. I'm bringing three protein bars with me. This is really simple. It's just a PB&J that I'm gonna have for lunch today. It just sounded really good to me. And then this is some leftover pasta with a meat sauce that Eric and I made the other day. So that is what I am bringing for this trip. I really only needed food for today because when I get to Las Vegas tomorrow, I'm gonna get to be with my parents. So I'll just be able to eat with them. I need to get everything all packed up, my uniform on, and then I'll be ready to head out the door. Miss Luna, you be a good girl while I'm gone. I love you. Just got to my hotel room in Phoenix and I immediately changed into some workout clothes because I wanna go get some cardio and stretching in before I get too settled and tired here. I absolutely love when hotels come with a microwave in the room, a full little kitchen setup and a full size fridge. That is so nice and convenient. This is such a big hotel room. I was not expecting this at all. We have the two queen size beds and this this whole area over here with a couch, the TV, and a little table. Look at how pretty that wall is. The bathroom is through here. And then through the window, we have a really pretty view of downtown Phoenix. It is a sunny and gorgeous day out. After my workout, I actually filmed an entire sit down video and I had so much fun filming this one. So I'll make sure to put a link to it in the description box below because this will be out before this video comes out. But right now I am currently editing it. Right now it's almost five o'clock. So I think I'm gonna edit for another hour and see where I get to, but I am starting to get a little bit hungry. So um, probably around 6 p.m. I'll make my dinner, but I want to get a little bit more editing done before then. I 
just got out of the shower and it is only 7 50 p.m right now which is wonderful because i am ready to start winding down and getting ready for bed i'm gonna read my book i just started this one it's called something wilder by christina lauren and if you guys remember i talked about the book love and other words that was also written by christina lauren and that was a five-star read for me probably one of the top 10 books that i've ever read i loved that book so i'm really excited to continue reading this one by the same authors it's um two best friends that write together one girl is named christina and the other girl is named lauren and they co-author um the books that they write together there is a two hour time zone change though so it is almost 10 p.m dallas time so i should be getting tired pretty soon i will see you guys tomorrow morning good night Good morning, everybody. It is currently 6.45 a.m. I slept great last night. Seriously, as soon as my head hit the pillow, I was knocked out until my alarm went off this morning at 6.30. And this hotel gives us free breakfast from 6 to 9 a.m. So this really is turning into just the best trip ever. Our pickup today isn't until 8.30 a.m., which is so nice. I have plenty of time to go eat and get ready without feeling rushed. So I'm gonna go eat and then get ready for the day. I'm actually already back in my room from breakfast. I just grabbed this to make in my room. Oh, and they also had this little peanut butter packet that I'm gonna put in my oatmeal. Do any of you like putting peanut butter in your oatmeal? I think it tastes so good. I also grabbed some tea packets. Orange and spice is my favorite flavor of tea, I guess you could say. And then I have never seen a cinnamon apple tea before so I had to grab this and try it. I was so sad because I was thinking I wouldn't have a spoon for my oatmeal but I forgot I'm in a little kitchenette and they have all the silverware down here. This is so nice. I am just about ready to go now. I just need to put my hair up and finish picking up my room but we got really lucky and we only have one flight today and that is from Phoenix to Las Vegas. Originally today we were supposed to go from Detroit to Phoenix this morning and then from Phoenix to Las Vegas. But since we were so delayed yesterday and missed that flight to Detroit, we got to stay here, which means we got extra sleep and whatnot. And so instead of having two flights today, now we only have one. And I'm guessing it's going to be a really short flight too. Today is going to be a great day. I'm really excited to see my parents. So I will see you guys when we get to Las Vegas. I am in Vegas now, just hanging out at my parents' house. My dad and I went and grabbed tacos on the way home. He picked me up from the airport, which was super nice. And so we've just been hanging out and it's my dad's day off of work, which is awesome. And we're waiting for my mom to get home. She's a teacher and I think school just got out. So she should be home soon. And then we're going to a concert tonight, which is gonna be really fun. From the Las Vegas airport. It is, I think, 5.40 a.m. right now. I'm just heading towards security so I can get to my gate. But today is day three of our three-day trip, so it is go home day. And we just have one flight today, and that is from Las Vegas back home to DFW.
<laughs> Hi, honey bunny. Oh, you bring me your shoe. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, baby girl. Oh, you got his shoe. <laughs> so silly. Hi, baby girl. I missed you. Hi, Miss Luna. Are you just sniffing all my bags? Hey you guys, so I actually got back from this trip almost two weeks ago and I don't know if you can tell with my voice because it sounds not completely normal, but I actually lost my voice this whole last week. Um, I was really, really sick. That is why my content has been coming out a little bit slower than usual just because I am trying to heal and get better and obviously I can't film and make content when I didn't have a voice. So I just wanted to give you guys that little update, but the next video I am going to film is going to be a full life update and Q&A. So you guys have that to look forward to and then obviously my flight attendant trips and vlogs in May. But I just wanted to take a second to say thank you so much to each and every Every one of you for watching this video and for continuing to support me and my channel. I hope that you all are having a fabulous day and I'll see you next time. Bye!